Hello guys, my name is Maximo, Afrobeat producer and a mixer junior. Um, welcome again to my YouTube channel. So today we are going to be talking about finding the key of a sample. Like if you are given a sample and you don't know the key, this is one one technical stuff that that really gets people upset, especially if you don't know music theory, if you are not good at playing the piano or finding the key of a specific song. So there's a shortcut. I'm going to be using two methods. The first one is using Edison in Butte plugin in FS Studio and an external plugin. So this is a sample. Um, this is a sample. I don't know the key. So let's let's play. Let's let's listen to it. So, finding the sample, finding the, the key of this sample is very simple. Just follow the process. Um, as usual, you double click and you just come over here, edit, uh, edit in audio editor. That's you are going to Edison. You click on and you move on to Edison. Then you click this icon here and you move on to what detect pitch region detect what pitch region double click it and you zoom in as you can see the root note here that is starting it is what b b b though this is not 100 percent accurate you just have to be selective this is b b b b key b and f sharp f sharp f sharp it returns back to e then from e it goes back to g f sharp again and it moves back to b if you can see the dominating note here is b so this will give you the dominating key here is b so this will give you an int of what it is so we already got it is it the key the this sample lies on key b so we are going to mess with key b on our uh, midi keyboard to try and get it uh, the way i normally do this is uh i play a bass I usually use the bass, uh, any bass plugin to get uh, what I'm looking for. Oh God! So let's let's play, let's play. So this is the sample. I'm trying to look. I'll try. This is a bass that I've set up. So I'm going to look for B. So this is B. So let me play the notes. The the full sample. As you can see, as you can see, the B goes with it. The B goes with it. So I have to find the other notes. So as you can see, B goes with it. So I have to find the other notes. You have to practice it and try with all keys. Except you are uh, a good pianist or you are a very good instrumentalist. You have to find the key. So let's go again. Still not correct. That's it, that's it. So the first thing is getting what? The root note. Getting this root note, this B. Getting this root note. So the second method is still quite simple. Still follow the same process. Uh, it's using an external plugin. And what an external plugin. So this plugin is called G Tune. So you play the sample and you see let G Tune detect what the 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 key. So you can see it's loading B. B B key B is one of the most prominent key. So this gives this basically gives me an hint of what okay the sample is made up of like the key is made up of so everything lies on b so from there we can build it so and that's all those are the specific two methods using uh, edison and also using um your gtune plugin so that's all for today if you enjoyed the video and you got something very good from it please subscribe below and like and drop a comment 
if you have any other uh, tutorial that you want me to work on you could drop it as a comment below so uh i'll get back to you guys see you guys next before then stay blessed